really don't. They have so many like roadblocks here and they check licenses and insurance and they check everything here in Manabai. And uh, yeah, like I've already been pulled over once. I, got, I was let go right away because it's an electric bike. So I don't need any insurance or licensing, any registration, nothing of that sort. So anyways, just sort of heading towards the uh, Tarki, which is a bit of a hoodie little area, I think. I don't know. I never see any fucking expats down here, so we'll see. Let's go see today. Seems how I got cancelled though for two on my firefighting haul and my haircut. But I'm gonna find another haircut place. And we're just gonna keep Bob Marley on too. My music not any louder. What's this girl doing? Look at this girl. Little skirt, waving a flag. What she got? Oh, she's just so cute. Cute. Yo, cutie. Bonita. Bonita. Holy shit. Oh, I'm just gonna give you a dollar, baby. <laughs> too cute. Oh. Uh, oh. What's your name? What's your name? Shirley Giraldo. Oh, Shirley. Bonita. Bonita. You don't speak Spanish. No. Canada. Canada. Huh? Canada. Canada. Ah. Canadian boy. Canadian boy. Tonight. Niño. Canadian niño. Ah. You're too beautiful. No, I don't want it. Para que pruebe lo mío, rico. Te amor. Tú. Probar, sí. Acá. No. No, 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 no. No. Te amo, mi amor. Yeah, Turkey. To my right. Actually, if I don't get a... If I don't get a haircut, I'm gonna buy a hat. They're like five dollars. Five dollars for like a good hat here, man. Pretty decent hat. So maybe I'll stop here, cruise through, get a hat. Yo, amigo, how's it going? Hey! Ah, <laughs> yeah, they don't really know how to take me. And I don't really give a shit. I am who I am. <laughs> Amigo! We're gonna go find a hat. We're gonna get a hat. A black hat. Even though I want a white hat, but it's a pretty dirty country, so you're hard pressed to keep it white. Because with all the sweat and shit. All right, here we go. Let's go find a hat. Hit me with music. Hit me with music. Hit me with music. Hey, lo siento. Quanto? Five bucks for a hat, man. That's a pretty good deal. Lots of cool hats. <laughs> kind of fitting.
What do you think? Uh, I don't know. Hard call. Hard call. Hard call. Man, I shouldn't get a white hat. <laughs> We're in the heart of the uh, market here. It's pretty quiet today. Uh, not uh, a lot of people. Just gonna really try to locate a hat or a barber here. Actually, I know there's some barber shops elsewhere. I want to go to a little more hoodie area to get my hair cut. Amigo! That baby this is what it's all about man. I love it. I love I love this market. Could be love. Could be love. Could be love. I've been fucking hardcore gringoed here, man. You know, before I knew. But now I know, so now it doesn't happen anymore. Let's just walk. Maybe we can find one outside of the market and just go raw and real, baby. Just ask somebody. We're going to get a fucking haircut around here. Right here is the barber here. Hola amigo. This is definitely the place to get a haircut. Brother there, get his haircut. Our man was looking good. Bueno. Bueno. You, you too. Yeah, Ecuador. Ecuador. Raw and real. Yeah. Raw and real, baby. Yeah. This is the place I'm going to get my hair cut. Super cool, dude. In here, I'm really 
look at Bird to see uh, what kind of haircut he's going to give me. I'm just going to tell him to do whatever he wants. And the music is really good. <laughs> Superman! Hola, amigo! Hola, amigo! Yes, Superman! 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 What do you think? Pretty cool, eh? Ah, there you are. You're gonna be on the video. Gracias, amigo. Ah, bonita niño. Gracias, amigo. Gracias. Hey. <laughs> you are so cute. You're so cute. Yeah, yeah. Me, me, poor Nino. What? Poor Nino. <laughs> See you later, buddy. All right. <laughs> no, no. Gracias. Hasta luego. Uh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Cheers. Cheers. Thank you. So this has turned out to be quite the experience. I got a Venezuelan hair cutter guy and a Colombian kid in the seat. I've been talking to them non-stop for the last half an hour. And uh, it's been really cool, man. I just, these people are so nice, man. You know, if you, if you got any fear about coming into the hood, man, that's your own fucking fear. You come in here with confidence and uh, love, they're not going to do anything bad to you, man. They, they will they will protect you. I believe it to my whole heart. All right, Ecuador Ron Real, baby. All right, man, we got, uh, we got some really great, I found the best haircutting guy in all of Manta. There's his shop right there. You want to you want to get a haircut? I'm gonna show you the after uh, hair. Cause look at this hair. It's terrible, terrible, terrible. So my brother, my brother, right in there. He's gonna give me a haircut that I'm gonna love. I just know it. They have been so nice to talk to. They have been just a real pleasure, man, in my day. I tell ya, uh, Colombian and Venezuelan. Why the Ecuadorians hate these people, I have no idea. I need to do more research, but I don't give a shit. Because the bottom line is, is we gotta love everybody, man. And here's the shop right here. So if you want to get a good, decent haircut, you come here. Right here, you see this guy. All right, doesn't that haircut look sharp? What a great job, man, for $5. And then, you know what? He didn't even charge me for the five, five for the haircut, man. He uh, said no charge, and I, I just couldn't do it. I had to leave him at least $3. It was five dollars for the haircut, and he said nothing. He not done no charge. Like how unreal! Can you believe that? Like really, no charge. I'm uh, in total awe and shock, man. These are hustlers here, and these are people that want you know want the money, man. And you know what? When he was done the haircut, I went to pay him, and he said no. I don't want to be paid. I appreciate your service and the video that you're preparing to do and that's exactly what I'm going to do is uh, prepare a nice video for these boys, uh, fantastic haircutting place at Nuevo Turkey. Yeah, the guy's just super cool man, he's had some super cool clients in there 
and uh, we had a really good time for like over an hour, man. I uh, drank a lot of cervezas and uh, now I'm just out here uh, heading back home and uh, gonna take a few uh, detours just to uh, just to show you what Ecuador is all about. So I'm gonna strap on the GoPro and we're gonna go from there. Baby, baby.